Welcome to Netripal Genetic Research Hospital. This is a lifetime license software and it works on any Windows operating systems like Windows 7 or 10 or any LAN systems from Windows 2014 onwards. There is no monthly or annual subscription and you are the owner for full version and all of software is installed in your system. This software comes from an established organization with over two decades of services and this software is in use in over 20 countries worldwide with over 10,000 clients and growing. For download the software, first we have to go through our website and click on that product which you want to buy and click on buy now. Or you can buy from Amazon, Flipkart, Snapdeal or Paytm also. If you are international customer, so you can convert price into USD and if you want to get a CD, so click on add CD shipping charges. Then click on buy now. After that we have to add all details on the buy now page and select any payment gateway or you can click on generate invoice for online payment. You will get a checkout page. Click on, on checkout, you will get a payment page and after giving payment, the message will be coming for download the software in link or your email also. Click on that link and download it. After downloading the software or when you get CD or DVD version, you will have a zip folder. Extract the file at a location in your system and open the folder to locate installation guide. Please follow all three steps one after another in order of one, two and three steps for successful installation of software. First step for checklist before installation. Second step for SQL Server installation guide. And third for product installation guide. During installation of third step, you will be asked to enter product key. This you can find in your register email when you download it or as a text file in a CD or DVD. During install now I am going to take you through the software to show how easily you can operate the software. After installation, you will be find a desktop icon and on click you will get a screen to create an administrator who will have complete rights on all process of screens. You can set up a ID and password here and remember it for login anytime later. Now I am right here username, ID and password. Give the permission for that user and click OK. Details are saved. You can write here organization details. Write the organization details. Select logo of your organization and click OK. Details are saved. You can write here user ID and password and login it. Now go to the setup administration and control. Login it using ID and password. You can now add additional users, doctors, specialties, lab tests or investigations in each of the setup screens as you find in the setup and administration module as shown in the screen here. Here you can add additional users. Here you can set up corporate companies. Here you can register insurance companies. Here you can set up laboratories. Here you can set up investigation or test. Here you can set up specialties details. Here you can set up doctors or consultant details. Here set up ward or room details. Here you can set up patient services details. Here you can set up insurance contract details. Here you can set up doctor consultation charges details. You can give the visit by charges here for general patient, inpatient, outpatient and the corporate patient for inpatient and outpatient. You can add here durations also. Here you can set up reference doctor commissions details. 
Here you can set up the packages for inpatient and outpatient. Here you can back up your data or enter into separate location in CD or portable drive or pen drive anytime periodically or weekly, monthly, three months or yearly so that you can restore them back later when you want it. Here you can set up the email and configuration details. All screen in the software will have add, update, search, print and quit so that you can update and patient data anytime based on user permission. Now I will show you how to set a patient appointment when they call you or visit you. For example, if a patient want to take an appointment at 8.40 pm slot, you can do as I show you now. First, check the schedule of doctor and set up the appointment duration which can take into 20 minutes or more based on specialty of doctor. Then you can pick the 8.40 pm row in the table and double click to add a patient name. Now we have fixed the appointment. If you want to edit, you can double click the same row and edit it to the changes as when you want to do it. Here you can search the patient details. Now I will show you how to register a patient. Firstly you need to select the category which can be general, corporate or insurance patient based on the payment mode. And secondly you need to enter patient details or bring the appointment based patient here and add minimum entries can be shown here. Or else if you want you can add all details in the screen now or later. You can write here patient details. You can add her patient image also. Give the personal information. Give the consultant information and save it. Details are saved. Then you will get print of this report here. Here you can add the details of the patient for reproductive history, family details and pedigree chart. You can add here. You can draw the pedigree chart here. You will get print of this report here. Here you can add the details of that patient for defects and diseases, health and mother and uh, past medical history. Here you can add the details of clinical features of the propositus. You can give here the all details of the patient. Clicking on sale, so you will get the print of this report here. Here you can add the details of patient about the expressions of the symptoms in different system. Here you can add the details of the patient about the clinical genetics and molecular genetics. After saving, after saving, you will get a print of this report here. Here you can add the details for the management and treatment. It can give the genetic counseling. 
add the details and save it. Here you can give the prescription to the outpatient. This can be used by doctor on his laptop or desktop and uh, all registered patients will be available to the doctor in case you are in land environment. Now the doctor can advise patient medicine test and also can write some brief on his diagnosis. Clicking on add details are saved. You will get front of this report here. Here you can cancel the consultant. Visit consultant. Here you can give the investigation orders to the outpatient. Select the patient name. Do the investigation. And save it. Details are saved. You will get print of this report here. Here you can give the outpatient behavior preparation. You can give the services to the outpatient. Select the patient name, give the service name or write the service name and save it. Details are saved. You will get print of this report here. Here you will get the cycle report of the outpatient, selecting one of the patient's name. Then you will get the outpatient consultation report, outpatient investigation report and service report also. You will get the pharmacy report also here. In inpatient management, here you can search the inpatient details. Here you can register the inpatient. Like outpatient, you can um, add the details of ward allocation information, patient history, and give the custody information and save it. Details are saved. You will get print of this report here. Then, uh, inpatient prescription, you can give the prescription to the inpatient. In ward management, here you can. Transfer the bed of the patient, select the patient name, give the ward name and save it. Here you can search the bed occupancy. In manage doctor visit, here you can register the doctor visit to the inpatient. Using this screen, you will cancel the doctor widget. In patient investigation, here you can give the investigation orders to the inpatient. Here you can give the services to the inpatient. Using this screen, you can estimate the bill of the inpatient. Select the patient name. You can give the far payment or advance payment here. Using this screen, you can manage the discharge details and dates. Here you can prepare the bill of the patient. After saving, you will get print of this report here. In discharge summary, here you, will, you can add the discharge summary to the patient. In cycle report, you will get the uh, all cycle report here. In cashier management, in manage out patient, here you can manage the patient payments. After pay the amount, you will get print of this report. You can manage for inpatients also. Here you can give the investigation result template to the inpatient or outpatient. 
the lab team can enter lab result for various stage as shown here in this sample screen select the patient name give the normal values for the investigation and click on test done by select the test done by and uh, save it details are saved you will get print of this report here in investigation uh, result report here you can merge the report of the inpatient patients you will get print of this report here now go to the pharmacy management in central pharmacy login it using id and password in manage location here you can add the location of drug details rack details here you can manage the drug details here you can manage the supply details you can add the supply name and list here here you can manage the pharmacy list you can add here here you can manage the purchase order details here you can manage the receiving with or without purchase order details here you can manage the supply payment details here you can manage the issues details with indent Here you can manage the sales or rise bill. Select the barcode of drug. Give the batch number and give the number of packs for the drug. And click add to grid. Give the patient name or add a patient name. Click on bill. Details are saved. You will get print of this report here. In manage credit or pending bill, here you can clear the pending bill of patient. In manage sales returns, here you can manage the sales returns of the patient. Here you can manage the purchase returns. Here you can manage issue returns. Here you can search the drug details. Here you will get the summary reports. Here you can manage the report header. You can edit here. Here you can set up new user or configure SMS and email detail. Here you can set up the opening balance. Here you can backup your data. Now go to main page. In client pharmacy, login it using ID and password. In manage indents, here you can add details of the drugs. Here you can manage. Here you can manage the receiving details. Here you can manage the sales or rise bill. Select the barcode of drug. Give the batch number, give the number of pack and click on add to grid. Give the patient detail. Click on bill. Details are saved. You will get print of this report here.
in manage sales returns here you can manage the sales returns of the patient here you can search the drug details Here you can manage the reports. You will get the summary reports here. Here you can manage the clear pending bills of patient. Here you can manage the issue returns. Here you can manage the your password. You can change here your password. Now go to main page. In HR management, in set up HR administration, here you can set up the qualification name. Here you can set up the employee type name. Here you can set up the employee designation name here you can set up the department name and details here you can set up the leave type name and details here you can add the details of the employee registration you can register the employee here you can add the employee detail personal detail salary detail next of kin remuneration revision detail and revival detail here you can add the details of the leave request of the employee here you can manage the air ticket entitlement you can submit the air ticket entitlement for finance approval of the employee here you can approve the pending approval of the air ticket entitlement here you can manage the offer letters of the employee you can give the detail of the employee remuneration detail personal particulars detail and next of kin detail here you can manage the service benefit end of the service benefit here the all detail and save it here you can manage the attendance of the employee Here you can manage the change uh, employee status. You can change the employee status from the screen. Here you can generate the pay slip of the employee. Here you will get all summary reports of HRM. In application setup, here you can edit your organization details. In reports module. thank you now go to the pharmacy management in central pharmacy login it using id and password in manage location here you can add the location of drug details rack details Here you can manage the drug details. 